Alright, welcome back, and uh, we're going to be continuing our Avorian playthrough today. I have gone ahead and farmed... ...a few of these... Uh, uh, yeah, a few of these off of boss locks, and while I've been doing it, one of my miners has just been constantly attacked, and there it has been destroyed again. And it's these, the certain faction of pirates. So I'm about done with boss walk so uh, I have my scouting ship up here we are going to send him out on another scouting run here but I'm basically just trying to find where these pirates are coming from and as soon as I make my way back over here with my new ship, uh, I'm I'm gonna wipe them out. Have I, I've got a little bit of a vendetta going now at this point. So I thought that today we could continue the quest line, though, which is to go see this hermit. Now that I have. Uh, beaten boss walks finally and yes I know I, I should have progressed the quest line a long time ago but yeah <sighs> so we're going to continue this quest line a little bit Okay, so he's doing that, and here in a, here shortly I will be going over here to go ahead and kill the AI boss as well, but I'll probably stick around here and farm up uh, one more boss walks fight before I head over this way. I was going to, yes, right here. I'm going to have to go rebuild my mining ship. So, th that pirate faction keeps sending um, persecutors after me. And they will only attack... If I leave my mining ships alone, they, they won't actually attack if I have anything in that sector that can kill them. And it's really starting to aggravate me, so I'm going to be going on a hunting spree here pretty soon. What's, what ship is this? I, I don't even know. Mark 30. I'm going to put him right back over there. Um, so that's about all I've been doing. Um, I'm hoping I will find a pirate sector with that faction and a shipyard so I can go in and just destroy it. Though, is what I'm looking for. But, either way, uh, I will bring you back when I'm either fighting the AI boss or that pirate fra faction hopefully the pirate faction but okay i'm back and 
yeah, it's sad how long it took me to figure out what I needed to do here. So I'm going to put all my torpedoes on five. And where the hell is the wreckage? So let's shoot. Why aren't we shooting? Oh, I have to activate them. And I just fired four torpedoes at it. Oh well. It's not like I bought them. Oh, it didn't... Try that again. Out of four torpedoes, you would think I would hit it. But... Oh, look. Pirates are attacking. Uh... Yeah, okay, there you go. Oops. Shoot our torpedoes. We may not. Wait, wait. Okay. <laughs> I was afraid. Uh, okay, they're immune anyway, so it's fine. I was afraid those guns were going to destroy them before. Um, <laughs> before I got the mission complete, but, but it turned out okay. So... Let's continue hunting pirates, I guess. So we'll take this ship up here. I don't know. Um, I haven't found just a pirate sector yet with a sh pirate shipyard kind of deal. Uh, it used to look like this on the map, and then it would have a pirate shipyard in it, and this would be red in this square, but I haven't actually found one. There was one I was looking at, and it said, uh, this sector is infested with pirates, so... We're going to go take a look at that, definitely. Oh, there are pirates here. Before I even load in, these guns have destroyed one over here. In case you're wondering why I like these cannons so much. <laughs> and this isn't... This ship isn't complete. Uh, I actually threw some random guns on the front of this ship. They'll all auto fire at this point. And the reason I'm doing that is because this ship won't be my main ship. Once we get to Trinium, I'll be building a carrier that I'll be running around in, and this will be a support ship. So. So I've put everything on this ship on auto fire, basically. Although sometimes their accuracy leaves something to be desired. Even though they are a badass. Not too big a fan of how they overheat either, but 
So currently with the setup I have on it, it's not as effective at long ranges as it should be. Once I have enough cannons to replace all the other guns with cannons on this ship, it will want to stay at, you know, 10 kilometers away from its target minimum. But right now, that's not the case. It's actually a little more effective if we get a little closer. And there's a sector cleared. So yeah, I think we've uh, upgraded this ship to the point where it is completely fine in the Neonite area. Uh, I haven't decided if I want to take just this ship to fight the AI boss or not. I think I'll I think I probably will. But yeah. Another exodus. Thing in my bobber. And this is where I couldn't live without the uh, universal adventuring companion. That loot collection range is so much nicer. Oh, there's a yellow. About missed. And there's a purple down here somewhere. There it is. And then we're also going to need to look, see if there's any claimables in this sector. We'll go ahead and get our loot. A legendary dual R mining laser. which I could um, well what the shit it's actually okay yeah, so I destroyed the beacon and it went away. Alright, let's see. Let's grab this because it's shining at me. Alright, more money. So I'm... I'm kind of waiting on uh, getting about 2 million credits before I build my next ship either way oh. auto fire and I don't actually know if this will help my problem of getting what what is this Oh, here we go. What was the note on this one? Hmm. Well, regardless. This will be a tougher fight because they have the shipyard here. So this sector will have tougher ships to protect it. Wow, they have already taken my shields down. 
So the plus side of this is it doesn't matter that much. I can just keep them at range in theory if my energy holds out which it may not are they not still coming towards me? some of them are So that's what I'm wanting to do right now. I want to build, well, I want two more of these ships and I just want cannons on this one and then I'll have a couple of others that have close range weapons on them is kind of what I'm wanting at the moment. And then once I get Trinium, I'll have a carrier kind of deal. That will be my main ship that I'm running around in. And just have two or three ships like this for support. But we haven't made it there yet. Taking a break. And this is probably why I'm having so many. No, this is a completely different faction of pirates. So I don't actually know where that other pirate faction is from that's causing me so many problems. Okay, well we're working them down slowly. Take a while to get through that many ships. Well, there's a few less pirates. We're gonna go ahead and uh, destroy the shipyard because I don't have uh, carriers yet because I'm not in Trinium yet so I can't take it over for myself and honestly the few times I have done that it really wasn't worth it because you still end up paying for the station once you take it over, seems like. Unless they've changed that, which I really hope they have changed that, but 
it basically made it pointless to take over a station because of that you, you really don't save any money from founding a station by taking over an existing station which makes no sense God, we have loot scattered from here to everywhere I wanted to grab up all the loot before we went after the shipyard but that may not be possible it's literally everywhere green was closer Okay. Maybe we've got all of it that's way out here. There's one right there. Well, I went way out here dragging these guys with me, didn't I? Nope, there's more loot down here. Crap. I think it's closer to. I ran myself out of energy again. I don't know. I'm bored. Going to pick up all the loot and I'm bored. So I, I think we'll just go ahead and head towards the space station and attack it. I'll try and grab things that are close as I'm going back. But And then to turn out this is the wrong pirate faction. If you can believe that. Okay, all those guys are fine for a little longer. This isn't even the pirate faction that was bothering me. I'm kind of curious to see how long it'll take these guns to take down that shipyard. firing almost 20 kilometers away yeah they're uh, they're going at it pretty good I'm not sure how I feel about them still firing at the shipyard when there are ships attacking us but And 
and that's the problem of uh, having your guns on auto fire right there. You really can't control what they shoot at for the most part. What is this? More? Wow. Okay, I've got to run a little bit. Oof. Nearly got destroyed. Oh, and I ran myself out of energy. That could be bad. On the plus side, I'm quite a bit faster than they are. If I have energy. I could just run around them and go ahead and kill that shipyard though. May have to. I think that's what I'm gonna do. Just kind of lead them in a little bit of a circle here. And go back and finish off that uh, shipyard so they won't call more ships in to attack me. those are hurting. Oh, oh, shit. Well, that plan would have worked better if I was paying attention. Yeah. And while I'm messing around with this, one of my mining ships has been destroyed. I would feel a lot more confident about this. There you go. I was gonna say I would feel a lot more confident about this if you would actually hit a shot, but... But they got it. 3.2k Omicron on those ships. To put that in perspective, this ship has 1.3 Omicron. So somehow these ships are like three times as powerful as I am. Okay, so we're down to two left. Which they have a lot of firepower, but they don't have much in the way of range, and they don't seem to have much 5,000 Omicron. They don't seem to have a whole lot in the way of survivability either, so I'm able to take them down fairly fast when my guns are actually shooting them. Okay, are you going to actually shoot him? Yeah, okay. We got it. It's no problem. Pirates are attacking the sector now. A pirate sector being up attacked by pirates. 
that's beautiful. They're actually attacking the shipyard. That's hilarious. Okay, so... We're gonna go ahead and finish this shipyard off and... While I'm at it, I'll kill those pirates as well. And hopefully we'll be done with this sector. But this is why I want to build another ship like this. Uh, this one's pretty good, but by itself, it's still just one ship. So we want to uh, want to get a little more powerful here. I'm actually pretty shocked at how close we came to dying while doing this. So at this point I'm I'm going to go ahead and have to go re uh have my mining ship towed and rebuilt and all that. And I'll probably put this ship on salvaging in this sector just to although it looks like the cargo hold is full so I may have to have him go refine and sell before I do that so this is what I'm doing while I'm waiting for enough money to keep building ships though so just a quick update and a little little action from taking out some pirate sectors and uh, I will be back when I have my world back in order and my mining ships <laughs> uh, rebuilt and everything going and we'll be going either to that sector or we'll be going after another pirate sector which I think may be right here but either way we'll be back shortly all right and we're back and we have done a good bit of salvaging and look at my money I'm so happy also, uh, I've got my two trade ships that are running trade routes in this area and they quite often get ambushed in the course of their trade routes. So, uh, one of my trade ships I noticed had a lot of cargo left over from trade routes that didn't finish. So I have it running around and selling what's in its cargo bay and that's going to be like 600,000. So I'm getting pretty close to building my a new ship like this one. And also the lunatic is now uh, repaired enough I think we will continue on and check out what this means when it says a sector is infested with pirates so we're gonna go check that out real quick and see what's happening I also got a new cannon. I haven't put it on this ship yet, though. Kind of waiting on that a little bit. 
probably until I build my next ship like this. But uh, another thing I've noticed when it comes to the trade routes, uh, you, you need to save up a good bit of money because the more money that you can give your captain, the higher amount of profit you'll get for the same amount of time on a trade route. So once you have enough money to actually let them loose with as much money as they need, you end up getting more money from that. This, this is infest. Okay. There's something valuable here. Is it really going to be this? Yeah, I'm afraid that's going to be what it is. Alright, let me... We'll see if that goes away. No? It's still there. No, nope, yeah, it went away. So, that was the valuable object in this sector. That's unfortunate. So, I suppose, I saw another one, I thought. Yeah, there's pirates there, smugglers. Hmm. Oh, also, it's time to send out our scout ship again uh well i don't know i guess we could go to this sector Yeah, we'll go see what those pirates are doing. Uh, oh, looky here. Looks like we'll be uh, trying the AI boss. My cannons do not seem to be having all that much of an impact on it. Hmm. I'll just be trying to keep my distance from it throughout the fight. I was actually looking forward to this fight though. I, I was kind of curious if this ship was going to be able to handle this fight. So I, I'm not upset at this happening at all. Yeah, I'm losing a few shields here and there. But we have about half of its shields down at the moment. And then we'll see how it goes from there. If I had known this was going to happen, I might have brought another ship to help. But, I think we're going to be okay. 
It's just going to take a while. Just going to let the uh, cannons do their work. This is what I was talking about though, if I had another one of these ships. I would be in the other ship, you know, in at close range with the boss, while this one could stay back and just fire. But this works out. It'll be okay. I think we'll be able to finish this fight without too big of a problem. Looks like my trading ship has brought me some money. These cannons do seem to have lower DPS, so... Um, because they overheat pretty regular. But all in all, I mean, like, uh, I, I don't have a problem with how they're performing. Okay, there goes the shield, and now parts are going to be breaking off everywhere. the parts of it might be more dangerous than the actual boss at this point. Might be beneficial to try and break apart the rest of the boss here so that it can't move as much. I think the small parts still move but they are not anywhere near as fast. Okay. That should do it. And then at this point, I think, uh, I think the cannons will be able to break apart all the smaller pieces without it actually coming close enough to threaten me. Although as I'm saying that, you can see the little pieces coming closer. So that may not be accurate. <laughs> Might still be a little bit of a threat here. Just not as much. I think we've slowed it down quite a bit. I'm not sure why this one part was so fast and so mobile, but but I need the loot. So I haven't really been all that worried about 
facing this boss because if I'm not mistaken, this is the uh, carrier part that we're about to get here. Which, don't get me wrong, is great, but I don't actually need it yet until I get to Trinium. So, it's not been a priority quite yet. He is taking my shields down still pretty good whenever I get in range, which is unfortunate. This would go a little faster if I could stay in range of my short range guns, but... And the reason I'm so careful about that is uh, I've got about three times as many shields as I do whole armor, like hit points, so yeah, that's uh, once my shields are down, I'm in danger. This may be about the most efficient way I've found to fight this boss, though. With the, uh, with the cannons. Because torpedoes just flat out don't work. Oh wow, it's not actually shooting down torpedoes. You know what? Let's fire some more. I don't think they'll like... Yeah, see? Yeah. Torpedoes are going to do nothing, so... This isn't the worst way I've done this. Yeah, I think I'm safe enough to go ahead and send her up that trading ship out on a uh, new trading run. Where is it? Lady. Trade. Oof, 1.6. I don't have that. You can have a million. Let's check out our mail while we're waiting. Declaration of War. Uh, I'm guessing this is from the AI boss. Oh, oh, they got a little too close. We're going to have to move. Yeah, he's still got a few parts left. And I'm just holding down the S key and kind of letting them stay at max range. 
We almost got him. a lot of hit points to chew through though. And a lot of loot. Definitely worth doing. With any luck, I got some more cannons out of this, so... Uh, that would be nice. Yeah, that loot collection range is very nice for after this fight. Okay, where are we? Got some over here. Good grief. Takes long, as long to collect the loot as it does to fight the boss almost. Okay, I'm going to go out on a limb and guess that I can go ahead and build my new ship now, I believe. Yeah, I have both of my trading ships out, and I think I sent them out both out with quite a bit of money, so they should be fine. And then, uh, where am I going? I, I know there was a couple more pieces of loot. Yeah. Is that it? Maybe that's it. So, yeah, I think we're ready to... Oh, I forgot to show you, I also ended up getting a Commodore Captain for this ship, which I highly recommend. Um, but yeah, we are definitely capable of building another ship at this point. So I think I'm going to go ahead and do that. Let's take a look, see what we got for loot here. So it's this one. Yeah, it's the carrier one, which I mean, you absolutely need these, but for me currently, it's not all that useful. Looks like I got a new laser. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm hoping I can have one ship with lasers, and j that's about it. I don't know if I'll be able to come up with enough lasers to do that, but yeah. Definitely going to try. Oh, Sky Comets. range of almost 16 kilometers on that that's pretty i may have to put that on this ship 
with the cannons. Honestly. That that may go with the cannons. I was kind of hoping I would see some new cannons, but I don't know that I'm seeing any. So much loot flashing there that we got from this one fight. It's just a little ridiculous. Okay, let's let's sort by type. And see if we can find some cannons in this mess. Um. Oh, I see one, but just one. And I think I may have already had that. Possibly. Yeah, I'm afraid that's going to be it. Oh, what? There's another one here. Why are they separated when I'm sorting by type? Sort by tech, maybe? What does that do? I really don't know what that does. Okay. No, I think the type is the closest I can get. But either way, uh, let's see. Let's set this guy to salvage. Just because I, I, I don't think I got enough loot from that fight. And I'm going to switch to this sector. And then we'll jump down to a shipyard. So that's the AI boss done anyways. Okay, so let's go ahead and just jump down to that shipyard and we'll look at building a new ship. And like I say, I think I think the next one is going to be a laser ship. Possibly. I haven't made up my mind 100% on that, but I'm thinking. I'm thinking laser ship. Right, I'm going to fly to a... I guess we'll fly to this one. I'm, I've also been thinking I may need to send... Well, uh, maybe not. I was kind of debating sending one of my mining ships back to the iron and titanium regions. Because... I was a little low on iron. But it seems like that's correcting itself. Okay, so I think we're about close enough. All right, let's build a new ship. Um, I'm going to call this one Wacko. And let's look at auto saves. Because I'm hoping it saved that new ship with the turrets, and it doesn't seem like it did. Did it? Okay, maybe it's this one. Eh, either way, we're gonna go with this one. 
Or, or, hold up. I had been thinking about making one of these. And I could make it a six slot. The trouble is, I can't see what this is going to look like stat-wise until I actually build it. So let's let's apply that design. Okay, it looks like it's got a hundred thousand hit points of hull and twenty-three thousand of shield. So that's pretty cool. It's going to need some modification, definitely. Uh, from the yeah, storable energy is low. Hyperspace jump energy is low, way too high for what we have. But if you compare that, let's go back to... No, ship auto saves. And I believe it was this one. If I apply this. Oh, that ship was so much tougher. Hmm. So I think we're going to go back to. Yeah, I think we're going to try this with a six socket for now. I, I think we're going to try this. And I'm going to have to modify the build somewhat. But I think this is the ship we're going to try to use. We'll put lasers on this one. Maybe. I think. Probably. Either way, let's see what we've got here. Uh, let's we have some framework. We have a colossal shit ton of framework that we can change at least. So, okay, so we need storable energy. We need money, really, is what we need. I don't think we're going to be able to do much until we... Put some money money in. I'm, I'm okay. Let's try here. Not enough processing power. Yeah, this is going to be a problem. Okay. So we can't mess with the framework. Do we have enough crew quarters? Yeah think so generator hyperspace core I saw that a minute ago over here hyperspace reach is seven sectors yeah I, I don't really care about that so we're going to convert these to energy containers and see if we can get enough to at least surpass our jump energy. And also, no, our generated energy is okay. Let's look at putting some systems on this so it can so we can see where it's going to be. Definitely putting that on. 
unarmed turrets. I, I, I don't really want that. I'm gonna put some a lot of my better gear on this ship though. Unarmed. Unarmed. Oh, definitely putting this on here. You can go there. Arbitrary. Auto. Unarmed. Yikes. Okay, looks like we don't have three, three. Okay, I think I'll just go with the armed turret ones. And that. And now I want an auto turret. Maybe? Do I? I think I want an auto turret. Let's try this. Okay, that's going to give us 24 auto-targeting slots. Yeah, that's looking pretty strong. Our required energy is still okay. Okay, what else did I need on this ship? Cargo hold. It doesn't have any cargo hold. Does it have torpedo storage? Not that I care, but if you can't pick up the torpedoes that drop, they just sit there and keep blinking at me. And if I'm going to pick up free torpedoes, I might as well be able to fire them. So I'll have to put torpedo, you know, tubes on it as well. Okay, let me, s I don't think I'm going to be able to convert this to cargo bay, am I? Nope. Non-functional blocks, so. So I have to convert something that we have. Holy shit thrusters. That's an interesting design. Uh I'm not I'm not touching that for right for right now. Um Wow, somebody put a lot of detail into this, either way. It could have more shields, I will say that. Uh, but that will definitely affect the energy requirements. Let's, let's do a few more generators. And then we'll do shield generators. Each one is adding not much, so. Eh, okay, so that isn't helping that much. All right, you know what? We're gonna call that good for right now. I'm, I'm gonna have to think about the cargo bay. On the one hand, I will be, where's the dot? Let's go over here. On the one hand, I'll be running this ship alongside the other one, and the other one has the cargo bay and the torpedo tubes and all that. So, 
There is that. Okay, crew. I have no idea how many I need. So let's hire those. Gunners. Hire all the gunners. I don't know about miners. I don't think we need miners. Uh, just for now. Let's go ahead and hire something like that. Just to make sure we have enough. Okay, so we're okay-ish down here. Jesus. That took a, yeah. Okay, we're going to have to fly, fly around and find specialized crew members, I think, for this. Still, new ships looking pretty solid. Yikes. Alright, uh, let's go ahead and throw some turrets on it. So, let's just do lasers. Why isn't it working? That isn't working. Hmm. Why isn't that working? There's a laser in that. How do I search for these? Energy, maybe. Nope. Nah. Yeah, I don't know. Uh, let's go by type again. Maybe that'll work. I don't know. I, I'm I'm gonna do this on my own, and I'll come back when I've got it set up. Uh, yeah, and then we'll go hunt down some more pirates with it. Alright, and I'm back, and I've got this ship armed and got a no-class captain in it. I couldn't find a Commodore to put in it, but I've pulled it up here next to my other ship, the uh, Lunatic, just so you can see the difference in them. Size wise, I mean, it's not that much different in size, but for some reason, this one has a hundred thousand hull and thirty thousand shields, while the lunatic has, yeah, fifteen, sixteen thousand hull and forty four thousand shields. Uh, I'm not real sure why there's that much difference, but there is, and yeah, I've found a couple more cannons to throw on this ship, as well as on the front there, that Firefly, whatever thing it was, I can't remember what it was called, the Sky Comets, so <laughs> I've put all of those on there. And unfortunately, so far, I have not found enough lasers for this ship. Uh, you can see a few of them there on the front. But uh, I'm going to go find another AI boss real quick just to have a comparison, uh, see how they do. Well, both of them. I want to see how the Lunatic does with more cannons and the Sky Comet thing on it. And then I want to see how this one's going to work. So, we'll, uh, I'll be back here in a minute when I get the boss loaded up. Okay, and we're back. And, yeah, 
okay we got it off of the auto so I'm just going to tell this guy to attack and I'll see if I can get the boss's attention focused on this ship and see how it does just a just a few lasers firing off of this ship okay so this isn't actually the way I want it to yeah, here let's try this let's try putting this one to attack and I'll see if I can keep this one at range a little bit the AI control yeah I'm not too enthused with it <laughs> does seem to be putting out quite a bit of damage now though yeah look at I put that other ship on AI control and now it's just flying around all over the place so You can definitely tell when that ship gets closer though, because look at the hit points going down when that other ship gets in close. I'm going to pull this one in just a little closer. Yeah, they haven't. The AI boss hasn't burned through either ship's shields yet. Okay, now this is more what I wanted the AI part to do, like when I. or that other ship to do when I put it under the uh, attack order. He's just kind of getting up in the middle of it and just staying there. That That's more what I wanted out of it. So it looks like I'll probably have to drive this ship and put the other one, give the other one the attack order. It's kind of the way it's looking there and you can see that he's tanking it pretty well. This is going quite a bit better than before with just one ship though. All in all though I am not that big a fan of that other desi ship design. I think I'll use it for now, but when I get to the Trinium sectors, I believe I'll be redesigning that ship into something else. Don't know what yet, but, but yeah, I think I'll be redesigning that one. Yeah, it's doing all right though. It, it, it seems to do better with that one under AI control and me controlling this one and keeping it a little further back. not unhappy with it although I think I need to change the placement of the guns on that other ship with them all being on the front and it being under you know the captain's control it, it, I think it would do better if I spread the guns out a little more
there we go. I think that'll pretty much finish this off. Shoot the ones close to you. There you go. Alright. So yeah, I I think it's going to be okay. I, I think I think this setup's going to be okay. But I also think I'll end up using this ship more and letting the other one just be you know on escort or whatever. get both of them to salvage so yeah I think that's going to work out pretty good um, I was looking yeah revelation is ready to go on another scouting run I have both of my uh, trading ships out with over a million credits each so it it still looks like I'm poor, but I'm getting I'm getting a little better off. So yeah, that's I'm working towards building a station at the moment. That'll be one of the next things that I'm going to do. All right, let's let's just not do this. Let's go find a pirate sector. Where were pirates? Asteroids. I think I decided right here. Okay, so yeah, we'll go test these ships out against some pirates real quick. I'm not even going to let them finish repairing. Although, I am going to jump in this one real quick. And make sure it has all of its blocks, at least. And then, yeah. Alright, we're ready. Removed. Why did it remove? Oh. It, prob it probably removed them from my inventory and put them on the ship, I'm guessing. So it looks like that ship actually lost some of its guns in that fight. Hmm. Not sure what I need to do about that. Okay, here we go. This should be jumping into a pirate sector, hopefully. We'll see how this does. Oh yeah, there's some pirates. Alright, so, wacko, go attack. And I'm going to keep this one back and just do a bunch of shooting. let the cannons do their work although it looks like we may have to figure out a way to make this focus because it's not wanting to focus it's shooting the wrong target <laughs> There we go. Now you can shoot that one, dum-dums. Oh, no? Still immune. Okay. So, Waco Escort. 
and we'll run at these others. Come on now. There we go. And that's the problem with trying to control more than one ship. I told it to escort me. And... Yeah. doesn't appear to be listening also my guns are still shooting the mothership and doing nothing so that's unfortunate Hopefully we can get this thing down pretty quick because my other ship seems to be taking a truckload of damage from being too stupid to actually escort my ship like I told it to. So there is that. Alright, that one's down though. So firepower wise, we're, yeah, definitely doing okay. Um, not doing great in the artificial intelligence of the captain, but I don't know if there's a lot I can do about that. But, either way, there's my new ship. Uh, like I said, I'm going to be saving up some money here for a little while. And going ahead and trying to build a station to help resolve my money difficulties. Yikes. Looks like he lost a lot of his guns. I'm going to have to spread these guns out quite a bit more on this ship if I'm going to be using this one for the captain being in control but uh, let's just tell them both to salvage and yeah I think that'll be all I've got for today and I still haven't made it over here to do this mission but we'll be heading over there shortly just farming away at this point really so that's all i've got for you be sure to leave me a like comment subscribe all that fun jazz and i'll see you in the next one